Hi everyone, my name is Katie. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing, I'm hoping to do a vlog style for once in my life, but um, the things I've already done that I was going to include in this vlog have already been done, so I don't know how I'm going to incorporate that anymore, except maybe just show you. <laughs> um, I'm really excited. So I did end up doing Pit Mad and I got two agent likes. One of them was an agent that I'd queried back in March, and so this got me to nudge her, and I even got to message her because um, I had emailed originally to the uh, actual agency, because that's how it was back then, and then she changed to the query tracker form, which I didn't get to do, and so um, when she liked my pitch, I got to say, hey, um, do I like re-email you like for the nudge, or send a new one to the form, and she said to email her other email and so she'll look at it on Tuesday so hopefully fingers crossed I'll get an answer from her either way pretty soon and then another agent liked it who typically responds in three to five days so I'm hoping for news this upcoming week from her and then I still have one full out um, that was kind of my last ditch effort for goals I think um, starting after maybe in October I'm going to start querying with Project Emma and I have decided to put the Summer of Risks in for Pitch Wars. I got some feedback on it recently and um, I think I'm going to try to narrow the focus. I think there's like a lot going on and a lot to keep track of and a lot of characters to keep track of and so I received feedback to um, kind of cut out a couple of people and change this one other person's role and then either focus more on work or more on the beach scene which is actually really hard without a bigger rewrite because of certain conversations that happen at each scene. So I'm either going to, I'm going to do what I can. The whole point of Pitch Wars is that your mentor will help you. So I just need to make it um, engaging and attractive enough to gain a mentor for it. <laughs> and then hopefully they can help me on how to redo it all if I need to. Um, there's also like some pacing things. Like I think I might have said this before, but my whole setup is like a week long. And so I think I'm going to try to, um, call that down to just a couple days and then maybe, um, I need really the best thing for me, I think it's just going to be able to skip weeks. And so um, I think I'm at the part where day three is starting next, which is chapter seven, like a lot is happening. They're shorter chapters, but still. So I think I'm going to be like, I worked on Remy for like our friendship for like a week. So it wasn't out of the blue, blah, blah, blah. And then, um, go into the next week. So it seems like they've known each other longer than they have. So that this thing that I'm doing makes more sense, I guess. Um, I just, uh, I love their dynamics so, so much, and I want it to make sense. Um, this is one of those books I think I talked about how um, I put them together towards the middle when probably they should be more together towards the end, and so that's another thing I'd like mentor opinion on, but I really like what I did with them. I just don't know how believable it is timing-wise, and so even in that last edit I did, I flash forward one month, two months, three months, like, I tried to make it believable, but it's kind of hard, and even, like, me and my husband, we had a whirlwind uh, beginning, and we knew we wanted to marry each other within, like, a couple of months. That's not how, like, 17-year-olds think, but, like, in my brain, like, yes, you can fall in love that fast, yes, you can have that connection with someone that fast, and so... That's what I'm hoping, and especially teenagers kind of dive all in like that, so I'm hoping that it all is believable and you just roll with it, basically. <laughs> yeah, so I just got done sending that follow-up email to that agent, and now I'm going to work on um, my summer book for a little bit. If y'all are also thinking about doing pitch wars, let me know. Um, so far, I believe you get to send your first chapter or up to the first 10 pages, which is actually through my chapter two, so that's good for me. <laughs> and then uh, your query and synopsis. It's a lot less involved than uh, author mentor match, so hopefully it's good. I think I'm on chapter seven or six. Oh yeah, I had this whole scene. So another thing I'm trying to do is cut out. Um, I, I was trying to put a lot of like eco-friendly stuff in here and volunteer stuff. I wanted this to be a more summer beach, um, yeah, I don't really know, but she was going to volunteer at this dolphin rehab and do a uh, turtle nest monitoring on the beach and just all these things that technically 
don't advance the plot. <laughs> There's a lot of things in here that I just added um, because I was trying to round out the world building, round out my characters, but um, the latest reader was like, none of this is advancing the plot. And while true, um, stuff does happen at those locations later. And so um, I'm trying to think of a way to at least mention it, introduce it, but not make it a scene. Um, and yeah, there's this whole flashback of her and her ex-girlfriend that happens while she's at the dolphin rehab, but that's all that happens there. So I can easily move that for her to be triggered by something else and think on that memory. Um, but yeah, like revisions are just, they're fun, I guess, <laughs> but they take work. Yeah, I really don't know how to make this one week has passed thing happen because <laughs> so much happens after the previous day and it's like, I'm sorry, I did this to you yesterday and it's like, okay, well, I need that in. <laughs> like, there's so much. I don't think I'm going to mess with the pacing and the timing right now. I think I'll ask for mentor help. I don't remember, but it would have been nice if they do this, like, author mentor match where it says, like, maybe why you picked these mentors, what you're hoping to get help with. Um, because sometimes if I put that in there, like, and that's their skill, like, they're like, oh, okay, maybe I can help this person. Um, so yeah, I think I'm not going to worry about that quite right now, because that's just, it's too big of a change, and I'm just going to focus on some characters and some smaller scenes instead. So far in my revision, like a thousand words has been cut, which sucks <laughs> because I know I'm about to cut even more scenes. And so um, I'm trying to think of ways to bolster that back up. My word count should be fine for a young adult contemporary romance still anyway. And I know that doesn't matter for pitch wars, but um, I just like getting things as close to 70K as I can. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna stop right here because I'm gonna have to do <laughs> Um, a lot of edits on that whole like cut a character, switch a character thing. So um, I'm going to get on with the rest of this vlog. Let's see. I was supposed to film that we went to the zoo and I totally forgot to do that. Um, we are also decorating for fall and setting up baby girl's room. I'm getting ahead of myself in there because uh, I really don't need to be doing that until December, <laughs> honestly. <laughs> but I'm too excited. And once the crib is actually set up, I'll be putting like um, some of these flowers that I have, either like in a crescent moon shape or maybe like an arch for a rainbow shape or um, something else. I'm not totally sure yet, but let me go show y'all what I have so far. Hope y'all enjoyed this vlog. I know it was terrible compared to other people's, but I just wanted to give y'all an update because I said in one of my vlogs coming out that I was going to work on my adult book and hopefully finish that half in September, but now I'm working on summer again for Pitch Wars. Hopefully I'll finish it in the next week and then I'll have two to three weeks for my adult book to work on it still, but... I'm really not stressing about it right now, so. Okay guys, I'm gonna hop on real fast because this is the following weekend from this vlog and so I got to do a lot of extra stuff today which is like clean the whole house, do a bunch of laundry. Um, we were given a bunch of baby girl clothes so I just went through all that. Let me know if y'all like watching those types of videos where it's cleaning, decluttering, chores, whatever. Um, and I can try to do more vlog style with that. 
Um, I know it's, it's it'll be an adjustment because I don't normally like I don't know where to set up filming for watching me do that. But <laughs> um, I'm ex very excited that officially, as y'all are watching this, the Pitch Wars Mentor Blog Hop is going. So be sure to go check out your mentors. Um, I know a lot of people do that Excel sheet where they line up each mentor. I'm that person that has like a thousand tabs open. Um, so in Excel, you could be like their likes, dislikes, uh, special requests, and then um, what I do is I just go uh, tab by tab, go through my people, see who's a best fit, and I'll just write down their name with a star, or I'll write their name with like a circle, or whatever, and then whenever I have my condensed list, then I will go through that specifically and comb through again. Um, I really hope I find someone who likes my book. I officially finished writing, rewriting Summer. And um, I ended up cutting about a thousand to fifteen hundred words. Um, I did add some too, so I'm not sure like what exactly all got cut. But um, I did change a character's name, like I, I merged them, I guess, and then I uh, took out a couple. I took out a couple of scenes, a couple of paragraphs, a couple of lines, um, and tried to refit them elsewhere or like add to certain things. So I feel really good about this one. Um, I didn't do as big of a rewrite as like a reader suggested just because everything flowed like there was if I was going to take out a part I would have had to completely rewrite that part in a different scene and that was just way too much work for me to do prior to Pitch Wars like that's what I want to do with a mentor not on my own on the off chance that's what they you know like you need something to work on with your mentor so <laughs> I was like I'm just gonna leave this I feel really good about it um so hopefully a mentor likes it I think it has a really good hook I still am trying to find a comp title for um a fake relationship in young adult contemporary romance so if y'all have that let me know I have like a blank in my query letter that I'm trying to find a good fake relationship comparison to but um let me know if y'all have any ideas and yeah, I think that's it. Yeah, I'm really excited that I finished summer, so now I can work on my adult the rest of the two weeks, or I could just take a break, maybe. I'm supposed to finish it in time for October so I can work on another project, but we'll see. Um, I'm really surprised I went so fast through summer, but I'm very excited about that. So um, thank you all for following along. Good luck with pitch wars. If you're going to do it, let me know in the comments down below, and good luck picking your mentors. I will see you all in the next video. Bye!